hard to imagine that not so long ago this place was uh, underwater. I know, I know. It's terrible to think that it was. Um, yeah, on, on the drive up, we saw some of the erosion and the um, all the stuff stuck in the fence of where it was. So it's it's hard to believe when you look at it now. But yeah, the town's obviously gone through a really challenging time. It's just so good we can come up here and um, yeah help out these kids, brighten their day a little bit, and um, yeah get involved with some skills and uh, Q and A. Um, yeah, it's sort of really good to put the smile on some kids' faces. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. I mean, they, they came down for a clinic um, in a day at Arden Street uh, late last year, I think. Um, and it, yeah, we just really wanted to return the favour and come up. As um, so they made the trip down, it'd be good to come up here and, and see them. And we just did a QA and a in there. It was, yeah, really good. You could see the excitement on their faces. And it, it actually brings a heap of joy to us players too, to know that um, we can come up here and help out these, these kids who've gone through, as I said, a tough time. So um, yeah, it's great. Now, uh, big season ahead. Obviously, everyone's very optimistic uh, on the changes of the club. But um, are you going to get some help there in the forward line? Yeah, well, there's actually... Um, it's been a really good pre-season with uh, a lot of boys in, in all our aspects across the ground. But, um, yeah, particularly up forward, it's been good. We've got some new young guys, um, both uh, Charlie Combin and uh, Carl Coleman-Jones have been really good in the air for us down there as um, another key option to bring in but um, also some of our sport, smaller players have really stepped up but good to have Harry Sheasel down there he looks like a really classy player um, cam firing again so yeah we've got a bit more a few more players down there that can hopefully roll through this year and um, establish themselves but um, you yeah, know we're looking all right down there. Yeah, I reckon it's super important. Um, I, I always want to do the school visits. I remember myself sitting um, at school and having people come and visit, and you just think it's so far off or so, you know, they're just like untouchable. But like, um, I don't know, coming out and telling them that it, it is sort of possible to achieve your goals and dreams like that is. Um, is important because it can happen. Um, Luke, you just McDonald just answered a question similar to that in there about how Sean Atley was sitting where those kids were sitting um, a little while ago now. But obviously, his really successful career he, for him being from Rochester. So, yeah, hopefully, it gives them yeah something to strive towards to look up to if they are interested in footy or or other, anything else really. But it's great. Yeah, 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 definitely. The sooner, sooner the better. I mean, I know, um, I know we've, we've finished last twice, two years running now, but it really does feel like, um, yeah, the, something in the group's changed. I think, I mean, everyone's sick of being down the bottom and losing, but um, the feel around the club, the new trajectory we're on, the new game plan, everyone's really bought in, and those, all our younger players have really stepped up looking a lot more AFL ready um, and so it's going to be exciting this year to just we just um, yeah one step at a time not look too far ahead but just focus on that next game in front of us and then you might look up and all of a sudden you've had a heap of wins under your belt or whatever it is we're just looking to um, improve this year. What are your goals? Uh, my goal is just literally all, all centered around um, whatever I can do to make our team better um, so yeah, all, all, all team based really. I want our forward line um, to click really well. I've got Cam down there as, an, as it's funny to say, I don't exactly feel like a senior player, but um, you know, had not having played 100 games yet, neither is Cam, but down there we are the older boys in that forward line. So um, making that forward line gel and click with other lines probably be a good goal for me. I don't have any numbers in, in order, but winning more games, I'd say, is uh, number one priority. And, um mentioned a lot, but I mean, having been down the bottom, does this feel like the start of something, finally? Um, yeah, well, it feels like, it, it feels different um, this year, as I said, with the um, belief in the group. Um, we certainly know what, um, yeah, we, we've been down uh, the bottom for too long, so, um, yeah, it's time, I think everyone's had, a, everyone has had enough, and, um, yeah, it's time to turn things around and change, and, um, yeah, so hopefully, Hopefully this year is the year we can start to turn things around. Okay. Cheers, guys. Thank you. Thanks.